Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between micro and macro economics. Economics is defined as the study of how humans work together to convert limited resources into goods and services to satisfy their unlimited wants and how they distribute the same among themselves. Economics has been divided into two broad parts, microeconomics and macroeconomics. Microeconomics talks about the actions of an individual unit, it could be an individual, firm, household, market, industry, etc. On the other hand, the macroeconomics studies the economy as a whole, that is, it assesses not a single unit but the combination of all the firms, households, nation, industries, market, etc. So, let's look into the basic differences between microeconomics and macroeconomics in a tabular form. Difference number 1, the branch of economics that studies the behavior of an individual consumer, firm, family is known as microeconomics, whereas, the branch of economics that studies the behavior of the whole national and international economy, is known as macroeconomics. Number 2, microeconomics deals with individual economic variables, whereas, macroeconomics deals with aggregate economic variables. Number 3, Microeconomics is applied to operational or internal issues, whereas, macroeconomics is applied to environment and external issues. Number 4. Demand and supply are tools of microeconomics, whereas, aggregate demand and aggregate supply are tools of macroeconomics. Number 5. Microeconomics assumes that all macroeconomic variables are constant, whereas, macroeconomics assumes that all microeconomic variables are constant. Number 6, Microeconomics is concerned with theory of product pricing, theory of factor pricing, and theory of economic welfare, whereas, Macroeconomics is concerned with theory of national income, aggregate consumption, theory of general price level, and economic growth. Number 7, Microeconomics covers various issues like demand, supply, product pricing, factor pricing, production, consumption, economic welfare, etc., whereas, macroeconomics covers various issues like, national income, general price level, distribution, employment, money, etc. Number 8, microeconomics is helpful in determining the prices of a product along with the prices of factors of production, land, labor, capital, entrepreneur, etc., within the economy, whereas, macroeconomics maintains stability in the general price level and resolves the major problems of the economy like inflation, deflation, reflation, unemployment and poverty as a whole. And, difference number 9, microeconomics is based on unrealistic assumptions, that is, in microeconomics it is assumed that there is a full employment in the society which is not at all possible. Whereas, in macroeconomics it has been analyzed that fallacy of composition involves, which sometimes doesn't proves true, because it is possible that what is true for aggregate may not be true for individuals too.